Hello everyone and welcome back to RimWorld. We joined the Naughty Boys on yet another rainy night in Farmerton where they have just collected their first crop of Ambrosia. 47 from that haul and 52 from this one. And I believe Reynard has already helped himself with some of the good stuff. And as you can see, it gives them a permanent move buff of 5. Well, that is, it gives them a mood buff for as long as that buff is active. I'm not exactly sure what the expiry rate is on it, but it's pretty slow. Um, they can probably eat one a day and be pretty damn happy with themselves. Okay, you're going to sleep. How about you, uh, instead of sowing there, how about you haul some of that hay and then catch some Z's, my man. Okay, you've got some inspired trade, which is thankfully not time-based. It'll just be the next trade we do, which is going to be today's mission. We're going to make our trip up to our closest neighbors, which are over here, the Southern Irialanor Democratic Confederacy who is requesting gold and giving us silver, but I don't have enough gold. They want 100 gold, and I really doubt we can find gold. But we have had a bulk goods trader just arrive, so let's see. Would they be able to sell me the 100 gold needed? They would, and they'd be able to sell it to me at a price of 15.57, and I'd receive almost 2,000 for it. So I'd be making 400 silver profit. So that sounds like a pretty good deal to me. We just need to be able to make this trade so that we can make the other trade. Now, I'd rather keep this stuff for sale to the other group, simply because we can haul um, all of these clothing, this clothing and stuff to the other Outlander Union and the one next to it in an attempt to trade there. But I am going to sell the uh, damaged and uh, dead man's clothing now simply because I don't think that we're going to get that much of a better price and it's nice just to clear out the stockpile from time to time. We can also purge some of our partial leather stacks because hauling all of that's a bit of a mission. Um, we can also haul all sorts of parts. So marble blocks can go. Lovely. We can sell these psychoid loos before they rot. That Those hops leaves can go as well. Not that they're worth much. Um, we have now enough to complete the transaction. Perfect. What else have we got to sell? We could sell all the beer, but I'd rather take that with us, because that has a market value of 12. So if we can get a better value, that would be fantastic. Uh, what else we got? Alpaca hide can go, Arctic wool skin. Anything that's not enough to make some cowboy hats out of is going to get perched. Okay. That's looking pretty good. Um, we've got alpha beaver meat, we've got bork. Uh, we got a whole bunch of simple meals and such, but I think for now that shall suffice. Yeah, we don't want to take any, maybe we want to get cows? We could use cows. We don't have the money for cows if we're going to do this gold hustle. Okay, let's do it. Since we're heading that way anyway, it seems to be worth our time to do this, so let's accept. Okay, lovely, we have the gold. Now, let's quickly go ahead and put together our caravan before this episode runs on too long and I forget to do this. So, we're going to be taking Reynard. We're going to be taking a couple of good shots. So let's take some of our new people. We'll take Minoka, who has not yet got a name, by the way. Um, uh, this is, of course, all being recorded in bulk. This episode's 11, 12, and this 13 are being recorded in one sitting. So if you have requested your name in game, it will be coming in with the next set. Uh, we've got, I think we'll take Milk along with us as well, because if I remember correctly, uh, he's a terrible shot, but no, he's a crafter. We want a Reynard's a bad doctor. Minoka, what was you? You were good at shooting. Yeah, you'll be our guard, and then we should probably take a medic, but not one of our good medics. Um, I think, actually, you know what? Just the two of them should be fine. So we'll grab, we've got some little baby alpacas. Nah, we'll take, which alpacas are these? Are these male or female? Hard to tell. So we'll take three alpacas with us, right? Which gives us 175 kilograms of carry capacity. We'll take a, a crap ton of hay to feed them all. Lovely. We'll take some simple meals to feed ourselves. Lovely. We'll grab, and then we can start, yeah, sort of loading up all this clothing. Um, who exactly are we going to? We, go. we can take some knives and sell all of this stuff. Not the shotgun, that we can still use. Take all the tribal wear, all this clothing. All of this stuff here. Okay, cool. We haven't got all that much, to be honest. A lot of cowboy hats, which is nice. We can take all of our gold. Uh, well, actually, we'll take 100 gold, exactly, because that's what they're requesting. We you have the silver. We'll take our silver with us anyway. 
Now we still have plenty of weight, so why don't we load up on other stuff we can use? We can sell those scythe blades, or we can try to. Um, hmm. We can attempt to sell. Keep the uranium. Keep the plasteel. We can take all the ambrosia, and the beer. Yes. Where's that beer? There we go. We can try and sell all of that beer. Uh, we're almost full, so why don't we grab a few of these leather stacks? And we can sell those as well. Um, we purged a lot of the partial ones. Damn. Uh, let's grab. Rhino hide's pretty tough. I want to use that. Maybe we'll take beaver skin. Yeah, we'll take beaver skin and pig skin along with this as well. Okay, cool. We got a bit of extra carry capacity. That's okay. I'm probably going to use that just to grab just a little bit more hay. Okay, just to make sure all our packers will be fine. All right, now let's just make sure everybody here who is going does in fact have a weapon. So we got Reynard. And Minoka leaving, right? Minoka, you need your shotgun back, so come and equip it. There we go. Okay, so we only have one guard on the team, but that's okay. We should survive regardless. Uh, would you be willing to... Emilio, neither of you haul... What's wrong with you? Fibrous Mechanite still. Mike, you're tending to Emilio. That's good. Okay, Milk, you're still making clothing. Uh, Noah and Mike are doing those. We don't need them. Orange is doing that one. Orange is no longer a person. <laughs> uh, a pack of wool cowboy hat on the ground. Okay, he's going to be making us um, all sorts of other stuff because, right? Yeah, you're doing button down shirts. Yeah, because the, the builds are revealing themselves now. Yeah, because we'll be taking all the dusters and things for trade. Okay, that's fine. Okay, we're slowly clearing all this out. Lovely. Is this one not coming with, or did that just get made? I don't mind too much. Okay, you guys, beers now. Cool. Load them up. Take them all. Mike, are you on this caravan? I didn't think I signed you. Anyway, we should probably get some more research going. So let's go ahead and grab... Hmm. Maybe we should start doing the ship construction, right? This is the end game. So, yeah. Oh, maybe get medicine. Yeah, let's get medicine. Let's research that. Because then once we can buy some, maybe we can buy some neutroamine. And everyone should have left the map. There we go. Caravan is ready. Okay, you guys, come on up here. Visit Ridgetown at the cliff. And they should be on their way. We didn't ever get, get to these uh, prisoner camps, which is a shame, but it's okay. Okay, so Reynard and Minoka are on their way. We could do a quick run in an attempt to save Lavago here. We, I mean, we can only use more colonists, right? Okay, you guys are resting. Yeah, you know what? Let's go on a hunt. Let's go do something exciting. So, world, uh, form caravan. Oh, no, wait, hold on. So, who's got the good guns? Let's actually check that first. So, Mo. We want to take Mo, Moomba, Mike, Emilio, and we'll leave Milk and Noah behind to defend the colony. Okay, so. Uh, let's form a caravan. We're going to get Mo, Mike, Moomba, and Emilio are going to go. Fantastic. They're going to grab some medicine. They're going to take 50 herbal medicine just to look after themselves, as well as a fair whack of meals to eat. Okay, 3.3 days worth of food. That's good. Uh, we got some more beer that came out. That's fine, though. And yeah, that's pretty much all we need to take, though, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, cool. Accept. Uh-huh. Confirm. Form that caravan, please and thank you. Okay, they'll wake up, go and grab their goods, and then they should head out immediately. Okay, yes, there they go. What are you two doing? You are running now. And you guys are heading out that way. Sweet. That's the correct direction for you. Okie dokes. Uh, we do need to get all this shit hauled in at some point as well. Uh, in fact, whoever remains can come and do exactly that. There's no space to configure to store it? What? Um... Turn you back on. Disassemble Mechanoid. Or do either of these two... Or let's let these guys leave the map real quick. Okay. Does either Milk or Noah do crafting? Milk does. Could you please flick the switch on that machining table? And then prioritize working at it. Prioritize whatever I'm saying. Uh, you are resting. You're going to visit the prisoner camp. Fantastic. And you're going to head over that way. Okay, cool. Three times speed. So we're adventuring 
adventure time with with Milk and Noah back at the base as the only people who aren't leaving. They're the custodians of our home. Okay. So, let's, uh... Noah, what are you doing? Oh, you're, you're sorry. Okay, that's I didn't know you were set to so. Caravan met by another caravan. Your caravan has met peacefully with a caravan from Norsty Tildo. The other caravan is composed of... Is this our fighting guys? It is our fighting guys. So let's try and trade. We have no silver and nothing to give them. Oh, that would have been nice to get, though. A doomsday rocket launcher. Oh, that would have been cool. We could attack them in an attempt to get it. And uh, no, they've got a pretty serious... They've got a pretty serious repertoire with them, so let's not let's not engage just yet. We want to successfully capture uh, Lavego Leve here. I have no idea if Lavego is worth anything. We'll find out, I guess. Okay, that's gonna happen. We'll be there in a few hours. Um, we'll be there in a few hours, around the same time, in fact. In fact, these guys are going to arrive there as this is happening. So we're actually going to want to get them to come and just pop a squat right outside that place, so that this we can deal with this first, and then we'll deal with that. Okay, how's the colony doing? Milk is presently doing that, that's good. Uh, you should probably eat, but go ahead and disassemble the last mechanoid. In fact, actually, rather, consume that single package survival meal that remains. Good. And go and fix the turret. Yes, that's very important. Good on you. And then what are you, making a duster? Yeah, make the duster, that's fine. Um, or actually, rather, since you've eaten, can you come and... Oh, Noah's doing it. Okay, cool, can you hold the steel there? Let's just get them to work while we're waiting. Okie dokes. Oh, are we almost there? Come on. Come on. Come on. Hey, there we go. Oh, oh there they are. Okay. So, oh, we got a bunch of tribals too. This is going to be a lot easier than I expected. Let's move everybody in. We're just going to pick these guys off as we see them. Oh, they've got some mushrooms. Interesting. You don't often see those. Nice. Fucking headshot there, Mike. Finish off Leopard there, please. Get Manatee. We just need to get them to flee. Okay, cool. We've got a Peace Talks opportunity. We'll have a look at that just now. Okay, Mike. Uh, we got no more melee people coming in, so I'm going to get you to circle round. Moomba, move up and get some cover. Shit, Mo, Mo got hit. Okay, sweet. Mike's going to take a shot there at Abaquero. Abaquero. Sweet. Finish them all off. Okay, who we got? Lur. Lur, are you any good? Nah. Nah, I think we can let Lur die. How about you? You are a pretty fantastic fighter. And you can be a hauler slash janitor for the base. Okay, now who had the... Who had the medicine? Uh, you do. Emilio does. Okay, so they had a prisoner as well. La Vega, that's our guy. So, let's go ahead and we're gonna say... Orders... Claim... Their entire property. Moomba, can you please come and free La Vega? Mo, you're doing alright. Come in here. So, I'm gonna get you... No, it was Emilio who's carrying the medicine. I'm gonna get you to drop it, Mo. I'm gonna get you to. Uh, you get you're already doctoring yourself. That's perfect. Uh, we could try and get this person, but we're really gonna get Lavego. Actually, let's have a look at him. Oh shit, he's great. You just can't haul or carry. That's fine though. Okay, you can help me with all this shit. All right, and he came with some food and everything. That's lovely. I'm gonna unforbid all that. Come here. Uh, let's unforbid all this pemmican. That's going to be our food home. Unforbid these weapons. We can sell them. Nice. And let's also get Mo to strip lure. And then strip her. So we can get those clothes without the debuffs. Got some more weapons in here. Got a little bit of pemmican. Okay, so nothing too serious in this base. Uh, but I think we can go ahead and consider that a win. Yeah, let's get these components since we're here as well. Um, mine components, because we only have to leave here in four days. So let's unselect everybody, get them to mine out those components. There's an eclipse here, that's fine. Get this out. Yeah, we've got four days till we have to leave. So let's, you know what, we can go ahead 
and use this to capture her. We might be able to get another person out of this raid. That would be amazing. And some components will not go awry. Not in the slightest. So let's also go ahead and get our other try our other caravan to visit there. Hopefully they'll do it before they have to rest for the night. Hey, okay, so we can trade. Um, let's go ahead and offer them all of our good stuff. So, we for some reason have some corn and some rice. Uh, we get much better prices. That's 20% better. Let's go ahead and sell all of that. They got a lot to sell us. We can sell all the ambrosia. Um, but yeah, we get almost a almost a dollar fifty better per sale uh, on the beer than before. We also get way more for our scyther blades. Those are usually like a thousand. So let's actually, we're going to sell those. Well, we don't know that we can sell those to the other one. So let's try and sell them here. Just like that. Beautiful. Um, and then we should try and complete that trade. There we go, the gold. So let's, let's, let's go ahead and finish up with all of this stuff. Just take all of their money from them. Good. Accept. And then fulfill trade offer. Confirm. Fantastic. So we should have an absolute crap ton of silver on us now. Um, gear. Items. That's what we need. Silver. Yeah. Look. Wait, no. Why didn't we get the silver? 500. 1600 foot. Oh, it's all broken up into different stacks. Okay, cool. Well, we definitely do have the silver we were promised. Um, you guys can then try and take the rest of their money from them. Or let's see if there's anything we want to buy. We'll probably get preferential prices on things like, yes, Nutraamine, $10 a piece. We could get a lot of that. We could get all this medicine as well. That would be fantastic. We can sell these leathers, all right? Sell the ambrosia. Sell the beer. Sell these shitty weapons. Nice. Uh, we can sell the plasteel knife, sure. Recove bows. The rest of this clothing. We're only paying 554 for a lot of Nutramine and a lot of everything else. Animals near mech trainer. That would be pretty cool. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Could get some camp fuel. What else have they got for us? They got pretty badly priced, or well, pretty well priced, uh, little world medicine actually, because that stuff's worth like 300, isn't it? No, no, never mind. That's 150% of market value. What are you worth? 18, and I'm buying it for 27. Yeah, but, yeah, no. That's not the worst price I've ever seen. Uh, Raynaud is our negotiator, so we got our good prices on the previous one. Okay. That is a shame. Are we actually, yeah, we are actually getting less on the beer here, I see. Okay, oh well. Um, could buy some frag grenades, a light machine gun would be great. What's the what's the damage on this thing? Eight shoots six shots. Okay, so you got a maximum of forty eight damage per spread. Uh, these things actually kind of work in a miss radius. Like it doesn't really matter what your uh, what am I trying to say? It really doesn't matter what your aiming ability is. It's it's just kind of going to shoot in an area. It's really good for firing into massed groups or for giving to someone who isn't a good shot. And a lot of our people are pretty terrible, so we're going to grab that. I think. A uranium club. Wow. Okay, give them, give them, you know, cancer as you beat them. That's a pretty extreme way to do it. Get a bionic arm. Holy shit, the side of the blades go for a lot more. Um. Yeah, I think we're going to call that good. We should start making some statues because those sell pretty well. As well as, you know, random bits of furniture and things. They're just so heavy to haul. Uh, do we want some helmets, maybe? Advanced helmet. Okay, what do you give? You give 40% sharp protection versus 30% sharp protection. A simple helmet, excellent though, will give 45. Huh. Could buy a couple of helmets. In fact, you know what? Uh, we can just make those. So I'm going to wait off on it. Hyperweave Tuke. You give 24% armor protection. That's pretty impressive. And the War Veil? 24% bulletproofness just from being out of hyperweave. That's amazing. But yeah, I think we're going to call that good. We could get a TV. That could be cool. Uh, make like a nice rec room. That's too expensive. Okay, that's fine. Confirm. And then you guys can actually come back home. Okay, where is Lesquaud? These guys are mining. That's fine. 
Do you guys not want to sleep indoors? What's wrong with my indoors, huh? Go sleep inside. Mo, where are you? Go sleep inside too. Okay, I'm literally just going to let them finish mining the stuff tomorrow and then we will bring them all home. Beautiful, because we could definitely use the components. And everybody here is going to be set to mining priority one. There we go, so that that is all they do when they wake up. Yeah, go ahead and eat, that's fine. You can also probably go ahead and uninstall all of this and take it home, because these are probably poor... That's a good chair, we'll take that. Nah, that's a good chair, we'll take that too. Nice. Pillage the world, you know, take from it what you must. There's some more components up there as well. It's not worth squandering them, so let's just... There we go. Everyone wake up, please go and work. Or well, you can eat first, I guess, and then work. Thank you. Why is it dark? Oh, there's an eclipse. That's right. Okay. Wow, move is really bad at mining. Holy shit. Why are you eating twice, man? Did you just not grab a full stack? You probably didn't. Okay, how is the home doing? The home. The home is fine, it seems. We have class dust is coming in. You've got yourself a new one, I hope. No, you got a pack of wool. Okay, milk is still our primary crafter. What are you doing? Consuming ambrosia. Is there an eclipse here, here, and here? Oh, there is. Okay, so now eclipses, that's new to beta 18, because previously um, on different maps you would have, you know, the sort of world effects not affecting you. So it's good to see they finally fixed that. Okay, we've almost got all of our deposits mined out. This is fantastic. We're nearly done. And then we can head home with our head held high and with a crap ton of components. Are you... You're very unlikely to join us. I mean, we'll bring them with as a prisoner. They can help us carry stuff, but uh, whether or not they'll actually join our colony is uh, uncertain. Okay, you guys are still good. You're almost home, which is great with all of our new spoils. And that's it. I think we can then say, let's close it up here. Uh, we'll take, you know what we will do before we go is because we can, no point saying no to it. We will take all of this steel with us as well. Let's just get that done real quick. This is a bit of an interesting uh, inclusion there. It's a random bit of stone wall. I think that spawned naturally um, and the game didn't really know what to do with it when it plopped this base down on top. Because as far as I can remember, it renders the map and then it renders the base in the map. Which is quite a clever way to do it, but it does end up with some rather strange things. Okay, so reform caravan. We'll take everything we can get our hands on. Okay, all of this stuff here. Yeah, take all the steel. Yeah, take the dining chairs. Sure. Um, what's that? Sandstone blocks. We don't need those. We will not take the human corpses. We will take the wood. We'll take that, 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 that. Uh, we won't take the wood, actually. You know what? Because we can rather take more weapons. Yeah. Take some of this damaged tribal wear. I think that's everything. And then as much, yeah, as much wood as we can carry. Okay. Let's just drop that down to like 20 wood. Okay. So that we're not too uh, over encumbered. And that was a successful raid. Accept. Yes. Come on home, gents. Sweet. Okay, and the other group is back home. Fantastic, Reynard, everybody, come on in. They will unpack the old packers tomorrow, I imagine. Okay, so caravanning around the world has been a success. I mean, we didn't exactly go very far. Oh, we can have a look at those peace talks, right? We got peace talks, here they are. And who's that for? For the Purple Rock Federation, that's these dudes. So what's this gonna do? Improve our relations, right? Site design for peace talks, yeah. We just got to send someone with a decent bargaining skill over there, so that would probably be Mo is our best, is our best speaker. Yeah, he's a nine. Oh shit! Okay, Mike's gonna slow them down a bit, but it's fine. At least they're uh, they won't be halted by it. I think the caravan only stops moving. I don't know if it's the majority or if all of your colonists have had mental breaks. Sleep, good man, sleep. You've probably had a bit of a rough trek. Oh, and we are completely out of food. Oh, shit. Okay, well, we can also try and tame these muffalos. That would be nice. We can order the hunting. 
of many beasts outside. It might be time to go foraging as well. I know, don't harvest the corn. Rather harvest. There are no berries for us. Huh. Bad time of year for that, I guess. Hunt things, hunt things, hunt things. Don't hunt the muffalos. Those are our food. Don't hunt the fucking rhino. I want to tame the rhino. Um... Yeah, hunt those rats, I guess. Sure, whatever. Hunt things up there. Hunt that turkey. Hunt those pigs and the rat. A lot of wildlife up this way we can deal with. Oh, also, let's go ahead and do this. Let's go ahead and throw in a steel door just over here. Just so we can access that side of the world if we want to. Put another one here as well. Okay, cool. Minoka's making us a little bit of chow. That's great. He's probably going to eat the corpse directly in this third guy. Yeah, but he's butchering it first, at least. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, you can just eat that raw. Whatever, I don't care. Okay, as long as you've eaten, that's good. So not everyone's starving to death. Reynard, have you eaten? Sort of. Uh, have you guys unloaded the alpacas? You haven't. Why not? There we go. Let's drop all this shit on the floor. At least it's... Uh, at least, what was I going to try and say? At least it is... There we go. Where's all the silver we got? Okay, it's already in storage. That was on our colonists, I guess. Yeah, there it is. 2,471 silver. Nice! And in total, we own... 3,650. Lovely. And a bandit camp opportunity. Ooh, and if we kill them, we get another 3,000 silver. And we can still always go and get that hospital bed. Interesting. Okay, the splitter rig. Those are actual bandits, right? With, like, real guns and shit. Uh, yes. Okay, so I don't know if we want to fight them just yet until we've got slightly better equipment. Caravan 2 has arrived in Farmerton. Lovely. Everyone's back home. Mike, you're still kind of upset about life. Okay, at least you're wandering back into the base. No, no, he's, he's fixed himself. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Okay, everyone's back home. Nice. Can you please hold these granite blocks? In fact, can you hold both granite block sets? Sweet. Hold them all. No. Hold the granite blocks. And then hold those granite blocks. There we go. Okay, Emilio is hunting squirrels with a freaking bolt action rifle. Seems a bit overkill, but you know, who are we to judge? Uh, milk is making penoxicillin. Fantastic. Can you hold that, please? Thank you. Mike can hold that too. And who do we want to give the uh, LMG to? Someone who needs... You're a decent shot. Emilio, Milk, you're not bad. I think the best person for it will be... I think we're actually going to give it to Mo. And then we'll give Lavago here, because he's slightly better. We'll give him the charge rifle. Okay, sweet. I also still need to make some more helmets. I need one, two, three, four. Four more steel helmets. Boop, 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 boop. Okay. And is everybody's helmet at least par passable? Yeah, we're also going to need four more steel vests, aren't we? Um, so everybody can have one. Good. Good. Okay. That's done. We got a crap ton of components now. I'd say that was a pretty successful run. All things told, uh, yeah, I got very few complaints about that, and that's rare for me. I usually complain a lot about, like, literally everything. It's it's sort of my forte. Minoka, what are you doing, brother? Um, you are taming the muffalo with our new raw fungus. Fungus. That's a horrible word, isn't it? It's a fun word to say, but it's not a fun word to, you know, have said. To you. I'm not sure where I'm going with that. You know what I mean. Uh, let's go ahead and we're going to do something a bit sneaky. We're going to deconstruct that conduit right there. And then we're going to go and say power. And well, I suppose we could do it on both sides. We're going to throw a power switch on. You know what? We don't actually need it on both ends. We're just going to have it on this side. And I'll show you what the purpose of this is now. It's so we can switch these turrets on and off. Because we don't need them running all the time. It's actually a bit wasteful to have them running all the time. So let's go ahead and turn them off. And then, when the raids come in, we can turn them back on. And that lets our batteries fill up a bit. Also, go ahead and get some more batteries made. 
Uh, Emilio is having a tantrum. What are you breaking, you asshole? Ah, oh, whatever you do, you're just gonna keep Moomba busy for a bit. That's fine. Hey, 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 hey! You leave that con. You leave that alone. It seems that by and large, he doesn't actually want to break anything. Just that he wants to damage it. That's okay. As long as he doesn't break anything, we're fine. We're in the good. Okay. Keep all these things hunted. I need gang food coming in, please. Uh, I also don't need all of you mining anymore. You can actually go off mining. As can you. As can you. Ah, uh, you guys can be twos. Reynard can be one. Although, Levego, you don't do much else. How about you just get good at mining, man? Or do hunt first. And then go get really, really freaking good at mining. You can also be our primary warden. You're not the best, but you'll be better. Oh, you are a great researcher. Okay. Do that. In that order. Fantastic. And Mike, you can get taken off priority one researching. And placed onto priority... Uh, uh, what do we want you as? You know, you can be a priority one hunter as well. It's not often that we do hunting, so let's just get... When we, when we schedule it, let's get it done, type of thing. Okay, lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Hmm... I haven't got much in the way of haulers. You, Minoka. You need to be set up as well. Let's get that done real quick. Everybody needs to be flick. Um, you can both be priority one doctors, please. In fact, actually, you know what? Let's leave our doctors as doctors and then secondary researchers. We'll have Lavego here as a primary researcher. He's slower than the other two are, but he will pick up speed pretty quickly. And we have a lot of researching still to do to get the shipbuilding mechanics done. Uh, so, then I was busy setting up, uh, who was it? Minoka. Yeah, you can be a grower, please. And then you can haul, actually. Grow, then haul, man. Or then haul, then grow, rather. Because you don't do much else. It'd be nice to have a pri someone dedicated entirely, literally, just to hauling. Uh, for doing this sort of stuff, so that Moomba isn't the only one doing it. Oh shit, someone's got the plague. Oh, it's it's just our prisoner. Okay, well, we're going to do something a bit dickish here. And we're going to actually set him free. Release. Uh, where is our medicine? Didn't we buy a crap ton of medicine? There it is, forbid that. No one is allowed to use the medicine. Use the herbal stuff until we need to. Okay, cool. So we've let, we've let Abba Conero or whatever free. So he should have made his way out already. Oh, yeah, okay, cool. And since we treated him, he left the map healthy. Oh, <gasps> we got a rhino. Yeah, the rhino's name is fucking Gung Ho. That is so cool. Oh, shit, yes. Okay, we're gonna have freaking war rhinos, man. You, you train that rhino. No, no, rhino, you're gonna live up in Animal Area 1. I wanna keep you safe. Okay, good. Now, uh really use a combat trainer to come in because we got the money now to buy some like decent armor and stuff like power armor which is so sweet uh, mining how's that going it isn't okay everybody's mining that's good I could get all that gold oh we could have got, bought, got the gold it made a lot more money I didn't even see that okay tame failed on the rhino that's a shame are you female are there not any male rhinos on this map a breeding pair of rhinos would be the coolest fucking thing. Can you imagine, like, farming rhinos? Ah, oh. oh, we got it. It's nature conservation, boys and girls. We gotta save them rhinos. We're gonna keep them all safe. Come on. Did you guys hear that the last northern white rhino died? Ah, oh, in, in captivity. It's such a shame. It really is. Uh, the last, sorry, that was, that's an incorrect statement. It was the last male northern white rhino. They do have still, I think, two females. Um, one of whom, or well, there's three females, one of whom is his, I think his mate, the, the male that died, and the other two I think are his daughters, um, or, or granddaughters or something. So, there is a very real need for, uh, yeah, there's a very real need for rhinos to be protected at this point, and it's not really getting done, which really saddens me rather a lot. Um, but the, if they can, um, in, if they can perfect the, what's it, the in vitro contraception methods, uh, or conception methods rather, then they would be able to restore the species using them as sort of like an Eve 
type. Which would be pretty fantastic if that could happen. Okay, how many blocks was that? That would be 95. And then a further 95 over there. Oh shit. We got the raid. Okay. It's just tribesmen, which isn't the worst. Um, they are going to come in. Thankfully, we aren't getting really many, all that many pirate raids at present, because those are kind of hard to deal with. Let us switch on the lights. And let's get everybody but Reynard to come down. I like having this many colonists. It's really nice. Um, Milk, come here. Mo, come here. Manoka, there. Lavego, there. Noah, you need a gun, man. I know I've been saying, like, oh, we'll give him a sword because he's a shit shot. I mean, yet you are a shit shot, but we don't really want you meleeing things. Actually, you know what? You can just go off and do your thing. We don't really need you for this. Mikey Mike, come up here. Okay, let's watch this happen. You know what would be nice? There's a few assault rifles in the mix. That would be pretty damn great. Because, yeah, we have got some pretty serious firepower we are now able to lay down. And that is going to make the defending from raids pretty damn easy. Yeah, they don't stand a chance. Lovely. Okay, we can also go ahead and turn this back on. And then we can unforbid all the weapons. Nice. Lovely. And then what are you, a Bruno? You're a good fighter. You're a decent crafter. We have enough crafters, though. We, what we really need is constructors and miners. You're kind and neurotic. I think we're going to have to just let you die, mate. Sorry. We will strip you, though, so we get some uh, undamaged tribal wear. And I think that's probably the last grave that Manoka's dropping off there. Yes. Yes, it is. Okay, so you are cremated corpses. Perfect. Okay, you should then probably beat out a fire. Okay, we've got lightning strike. That's fine. Uh-huh. Okay, Minoka, you will go and... Yeah, you're going to go and cremate those corpses. Remember, what do you do once you're done here? You haul it... You haul granite blocks... Oh, yes, of course, because we're building this now. Okay, lovely. And there's just, like, five blocks remaining. What the fudge? Okay, I mean, whatever. Could you please do these ones next? Just because I want that wood out the way. Okay. Cool. I'll do that. Okay, chow down, and then what you gonna do? Build more animals. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. I think then that with our base getting a bit more busy once again, we can probably call this an episode. So how many new people do we have? We've got people who need names are. We've got Lavago, Minoka, and that's it. So those two. So if you would like your name in game, there are two opportunities ripe and ready for the picking. You need only uh, like, comment, and subscribe, or honestly, just comment down on this video and let me know that you'd like your name in game, and it shall be in game. You can also private message me or message me on Facebook or whatever via the page if you don't want to make it a public comment that's totally chill with me too anyway guys i hope you enjoyed the video if you did hit that like button if you didn't you're welcome to hit that dislike button and i will see you in the next one cheers